Hey guys, Edmund here of Realistic Entertainment, and today we're going to take a look at the Limitless 5 um, drone. Now, I've had this drone for a while, but this is like my first time unboxing it. I normally use like a Mavic, um, a Mavic Pro 3 from DJI, but I had this for a while and I thought maybe we can have an unboxing experience together. So, let's check it out. So, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. You can see what it looks like. Oh yeah, wrapped up nicely. Looks like we got a bag here. Some of you guys may have seen an unboxing with this before, but um, yeah, just thought I would kind of put my little own twist on it. So it comes with a nice bag. I'm gonna pause the video and then I'll come back with it all out the box. So this is the bag, the white bag that it um, comes in. As you see, it has like this little zipper thing, which I do like. So let's go ahead and get this out of the bag. I'm gonna pause it and be right so back. So this is how the bag looks. Um, it's pretty cool. I'm glad it comes with its own bag. That way I won't have to actually purchase anything additional. And then it has the Limitless 5 on it. I do love that. So let's open it up and see what it looks like inside. So we're on top of it now. And this is a zipper here. Oh, let me see if I can get it open. All right guys, so we're back. The zipper was a little bit tough to get open but here we are this is how it looks when you first pull it back and you got your pamphlet and everything in here which is cool just gonna put this over to the side and this little doohickey scan it you'll be glad you did pretty cool mobile phone stents remote control and your drone right over here so let me get all this out of the bag and let's have a look all right, so this is everything that comes in the actual bag. So over here, you have your drone right here. You have your blades right here and a USB um, charger. Uh, we'll see what that looks like in a sec here. I'll have to scan this to see what this is. And also you have your stent, as it mentioned, I guess it's more than one says stent, so I guess it's more than one to hold your phone. I guess it makes it a little bit more convenient, I'm not sure, but we'll take a look. And this is actually your remote control here, which is cool. They have um, all different type of cables for the phones that you have. So this is like a micro USB. I don't know who would still use this in 2024, but hey, you never know. This right here is your iPhone charger. So, well, your iPhone cable um, to plug it in so you can have it as a display. Cool. And this is your USB Type-C cable for those of you who are Android users. Pretty cool. So this is, right now, all the things that you currently get in the box. So let's go ahead and open up some of these boxes and take a look. All right, guys, so this is what some of the stuff look like when you unbox it. The mobile stents here. And then you have, I didn't want to take the blades out, but I did take the cable out. And honestly, I'm kind of disappointed because I was expecting this to be like a USB type C, but this is not, it's a micro USB. I don't like that, oh. but hey, it is what it is. Um, I'm sure it'll work well with it. Maybe one day uh, during the next phase of this um, drone, maybe they'll decide to do a USB type C. And I do like the way this remote control was packaged. I like the cushion that's on top of it. Pretty cool, I like that. And this is what the controller actually looks like. Uh, I'm gonna see what kind of batteries they hold. If it's lithium, that'd be amazing. If it's not lithium, huh, mm, I'm probably gonna be a little bit disappointed. I would say that the um, the Mavic from DJI, Mavic Pro 3, kind of spoils you because it does have like a built-in screen on the bottom here. I have it in my vehicle, so I, uh, I could go get it, but mm, it's a lot of stuff to unpack because I'm currently working on a few projects, but it has a screen here to where you can see where the drone is flying and stuff like that. And to me, that right there kind of spoils you in a sense. Um, instead of just using your mobile phone for a display, you know, I would love for all uh, drone manufacturers to actually implement some sort of display. I'll pay the extra money to have that because it just makes such a it, it just makes for such a pleasant experience. But maybe you guys feel different about it. But so far, this is what we got. I'm gonna take a look and see what kind of batteries this controller holds. Let's have a look. All right, guys, so I am really happy that this is actually a chargeable deal. There's the port here with the micro USB. Yeah, but anyway, 
uh, maybe one day USB type C will be a thing for them. Don't know, but I do like the fact that you have to charge this. I had a Holy Stone drone and um, actually I put batteries in it. Uh, I don't know if that has changed, but um, I, I do like the fact that this charges. I love the way it looks, look at that, it's pretty cool. But yeah, so far, this is my unboxing of the Limitless 5 drone. I'll take it for a spin at some time, but I just wanted to do this experience with you guys. Let me know what you think about it. So far, does it look okay? I know it's not on par with the uh, DJI uh, drones, but we're going to take it for a spin and see how well it works maybe in the next video. Until next time, guys, I will talk to you soon.